What's up everybody, this is Charge Drum, and today we have another EVIC Box of Awesomeness unboxing for you guys. This time we have the November 1st Flash Edition Box of Awesomeness. This box is quite small and I'm actually pretty excited to open this because I think this is the smallest box I've ever gotten from EVIC itself. So let's go ahead and see what we got. I mean, the box looks kind of big, but it's just really narrow. So. I'm pretty excited to see what we have in here, guys. So let's go ahead and get this started. All right, guys, the box is opened. Let's go ahead and see what we got. All right, guys, the first thing that I've noticed in the box is our EVIC trading card. We have the 6mm Pro Shop M9A1 Bazooka. I know for a fact I don't have this card, so that's pretty cool. That's definitely a nice one, so awesome. All right, next up we have another Doge patch. We already have this one, but... Neat, another one for our collection. All right, next up we have probably the most smashed box I've ever seen. Nice smashed box. Some poopy BBs. And uh, our, um, what is it, the uh, TP45? Ah, uh, yes. As shitty as normal. These things are literally garbage. But other than that, it's a little dinky toy, so we'll shoot it later, don't worry. All right, next up we have another one of these uh, grenade launcher things, so that's pretty cool. Let's just go ahead and pop this bad boy open. And we got another one of these uh, six millimeter um, polymer grenade launchers. It's the, uh, the dual one, so you can stick two of your favorite grenade shells in here, and you have these paddles in which uh, release the gas from the, um, from the grenade shell itself. Oh, okay, so you just click this in and out, like like so. So here are your safety mechanisms. You just, these gun, these are ready to fire. And then you just push it in here when you're, when you're on safe, because it blocks the paddle from moving. And you have a dual paddle assembly, so if you want to shoot both of them at the same time, there you go. That's actually pretty neat. I don't remember that ever being on one of these, but cool. On to the guns. Let's go ahead and see what we got first. We have a nice little Colt box right here. So let's go ahead and open that bad boy up. Oh, Ooh, we got a revolver. Perfect. Look at this thing, guys. That's pretty sick. I don't think I've ever had a revolver out of all the times that I've gotten one of these boxes. So that's pretty new to me. Look at that. Oh my God, it's sticky as heck. Look at that, doesn't it? Oh, there we go. Now it's spinning, now it's spinning. Ah, uh, yes. Look at that, and it comes with a speed loader and six shells. Uh, you got um, an Allen key for your uh, your CO2 and some pretty crappy BBs. I have to like actually push that open. Take your thing, and you push it in. There we go, and then just slam it shut. Cool! That's a pretty nice revolver. This is a pretty nice revolver though. I kind of like it. I don't like the packaging. I hate the type of styrofoam. And then you just push it out and then dump them all right out. Probably scratched the hell out of every single shell that I had. Reloading it single-handedly though is a pain in the ass, we'll say. Does this actually do what it's supposed to? get it like they fall out so easy what's the point of that tool anyways at this point this is pretty cool i actually kind of like this thing all right guys next up we have probably the smallest gun box i've seen in a while for a primary this thing is insanely small and it's a sharp rose box so i'm pretty excited to see what we got it looks like it's the jack because it's got the skull on the front so we got our gun right here that is incredibly tiny I can't even get the gun out of the box, guys. Look at this. I... There we go. Look at that. It comes with two magazines. That's the first. I've never had a box that came with two mags. That's pretty crazy. I actually like that. What the heck? Oh, what? What? That's pretty cool, actually. So we got our barrel shroud. Oh. Does that not stay? This is small. I mean, you gotta put this on first. How does this go in? Oh! 
That makes more sense now. Look at that. That's pretty cool, actually, guys. So basically what you do is you line up your, your hop up like so. You pull this down and you pull it back. You pull this up or had it at first. Put it in the center like so. And then you twist it and it's in. Look at that. That's pretty cool. The trigger noise sounds amazing. How about that? God, this gun gets really big for how small it was in this box. That's crazy. That's pretty nice. Huh. Look at this, guys. This is a pretty cool gun, actually. I like it small, though. I love how they gave you two mags, though. That's crazy. Like, oh, the mags are sticky. I like that. And I just love how you can just pull this tab up, slide it over, take your, uh, your stock, fold this over, and then what? Just like this? Look at that. I feel like that would get dirty though, your hop up unit. That's pretty cool though. Just push it in, lock it in place, and you're ready to go. That's pretty cool. I actually like this design a lot. And it's, it feels good. It's not like a cheap polymer. The grip is nice. I love the feel of the grip. It doesn't have anything really on it, but it, it, it's an amoeba grip, so I know that. But yeah, this is a pretty nice design, and I, I actually like this one a lot, so I can't wait to see how this thing performs. Anyways, guys, let's go shoot some guns. This gun is pretty nice. I actually really like this thing. It shoots well. I don't have much to say about it other than it feels nice in the hands. I love the features that's, that this thing has, being able to take it down as far as I could. I mean, this is a pretty nice box, especially because this box doesn't take that much cardboard. This thing I can just store like in my closet and be done with it. I really like this gun. It's nice. I It's definitely a great gun. Um, Overall, the performance is excellent. This thing, we've unboxed quite a few of these already, so I don't really have much to say about it other than it's just a cheap Springer. It's nothing special, but it gets the job done. If you really want to challenge yourself, you can use one of these and maybe a Springer match. I don't know, but these things are pretty cool. The revolver is powerful as all hell, so that's pretty nice. I, I love how it fires. Um, shoots pretty rough, so I mean, the kickback is awesome and just i could click this thing for hours but obviously that's not good for the gun but other than that this thing is pretty neat i mean i've never unboxed a revolver and i think this is the first revolver i've actually had so honestly i'd say this is a pretty good box guys i'm definitely happy with what we got anyways guys thank you all for watching i hope you enjoyed this video leave a like if you did leave a comment as to what your favorite gun was and i hope to see you all next time thank you all for watching and have a good one